Getting to work with your loved one is great, but maybe don't if your workplace is WWE. Plenty of wrestlers marry fellow performers, and we often see that reflected in storylines. When that happens, the story is just begging for some kind of love affair. The intensity turns up even more when we see a married woman getting romantic with another wrestler right in front of her real-life husband. It's all part of the script, so let's take a look at a few. Rusev had a huge opportunity on September 30th, 2019. After saving the Universal Champion, Seth Rollins, from a beatdown, Rusev demanded he receive a title match. The Bulgarian brute got his wish later in the evening as he and Rollins went toe-to-toe. -to -toe. With so much riding on this match, the last thing Rusev needed was a distraction, but unfortunately, that's what he got. During the middle of the contest, Bobby Lashley came out to make his return, but he wasn't alone. Rusev's actual life, Lana, joined the Almighty on the entrance wrap and laid one on Lashley. While the two lovers were pleased with themselves, the super athlete was completely disgusted. During her early years in WWE, Tori Wilson began an on-screen romance with Tajiri. This carried into 2002, and on an episode of SmackDown, the Japanese wrestler was set to defend his Cruiserweight Championship against Billy Kidman. Before the match, Kidman met up with Tori and acknowledged that they had their differences, but wished the best for her and Tajiri. The champion saw this and thought the two were getting a bit too close, and demanded Wilson kiss him not once, but twice. What makes the storyline so bizarre is in real life, Tori Wilson was dating Billy Kidman, and the two would be married the next year. Well, this at least confirms that Kidman and Wilson are a couple of team players. Triple H and Randy Orton's feud in 2009 seemed like it couldn't get any more heated. Well, the Viper found a way to do that on March 23rd. What was supposed to be a two-on-one handicap match between Orton, Ted DiBiase, and Triple H turned into a chaotic brawl between both sides. Of course, the numbers favored the Apex Predator, and the game became completely helpless when he was handcuffed to the rope. Seeing her husband in distress, Stephanie McMahon ran to the ring and pleaded with Randy Orton. The third generation wrestler halted his attacks on Triple H and concentrated his attention on the Cerebral Assassin's wife. Since that wasn't enough for him, Orton then decided to lay a kiss on the unconscious Stephanie McMahon. Triple H was boiling with rage, but was helpless to do anything about it as the Viper slithered away. The Boogeyman had been terrorizing Booker T and his wife Charmel for weeks in 2006. It kept getting worse and worse until finally, a handicap match was set up between the couple and the monster at WrestleMania. Both Booker and Charmel were scared out of their minds, but the five-time WCW champion was all business when the bell rang. Despite all the abuse, the Boogeyman managed to fight back and take down his opponent. While her husband was stunned, Charmel attempted to interfere, but her plan backfired horribly. Boogeyman turned around and laid a wet, wormy kiss on the wife of Booker T. To top it off, the face paint performer hit the future Hall of Famer with a two-handed choke lift and won the match. Which moment did you find the most shocking? Let me know in the comments, and then check out the video on the right. It's recommended specifically for you. Until next time, I'm Zach from Tap Out Corner, and take it easy.